Hi my lovely viewers as promised I'm back with IKEA tour of Navi Mumbai I hope you will enjoy watching this piece of content as I have thoughtfully curated this video for both those who are yet to witness the store and for those who have already been there In my description box I have given detailed time stamp that includes the index of room inspirations loose pieces of furniture walk through cafeteria experience where to get your shopping products and what I got for myself This video has been executed in such a way that you will find every bit going through a flow So let's begin then. As you enter the store, you will first land up on the inspirational floor. I call it an inspirational floor because I have witnessed n number of setups in this floor. IKEA has thoughtfully created dedicated spaces starting from living rooms to utility areas. Be it your workstation or having a big first counter in your kitchen, be it a small cooking zone or narrow balcony. Be it a family who loves to dwell in a cozy space or a family who loves to entertain friends and relatives there is something for everyone and what i admired the most is the way they have styled the zones using their in-house products It's a different kind of lonely it's a different kind of sad cuz we got no more if only and we start to feel the bad It's a different kind of sadness It's a different kind of fear Now we're stuck in this weightless And the end is getting near So I'm moving on Here, the little details on the countertop are making the space worth inspiring It's like they're all watching We're on our way to the ground And I don't love you the same The drawers are also planned and organized well to give an overall idea. It's a different kind of lonely. It's a different kind of sad. Cuz we got no more if only and we start to feel the bad. It's a different This hardly 18 inch wide wall has been utilized at its best. In this way this and the end is getting near. So I'm moving on. And your cabinets don't have to be closed an open area with trolley adds so much character to the space Well now without much talk I let you watch the samples that I could gather for my viewers This wall unit has been built using two three sets of shelving units that are a combination of closed and open shelves. This creates so much drama and also it's more importantly very functional. If we're moving on. Yeah, we're moving on. Now let me take you through the bathrooms. The first one shown is very compact. Second one is medium sized. and the third one is giving an idea of having a separate wet zone 
Apartments having no or very little utilities area can create one like this. Now I witness different kinds of kids room starting from compact to room for two kids. They have worked on different layouts, different furniture placements and color themes. How adding little details that end up to be functional is what IKEA specializes in, I think. Walls were used to its fullest that were not only functional but also appealing. This bedroom gives an idea of overhead storage and I love the open selving ideas in this space. The second one was very contemporary and had dark wood furnitures. Dining spaces varied from bright and airy modern style to light floral detail farmhouse style. There were other two concepts that catch my eyes. One was this open plan living plus kitchen plus dining sample where the whole room was designed with a subtle theme working on every detail starting from furnishings to floorings. The next one is this peekaboo corners where one can buy the exact theme as so cased for your own space. When you peep in, you know the cost of the worked out space and it was one of my favorite. I have given this inspirational floor tour as a designer, guided you to think about your space from various perspectives starting from furniture layout to adding character through open spaces. If you people are not into interiors, it's hard to visualize what they are trying to convey through these setups. On the other hand, you may end up buying n number of things just because it treats your eyes, but it adds zero value to the space. Yes, touring this floor kills time, but improves knowledge and one that adds up to the knowledge is not waste of time. My motto to visit this space was to grab inspiration. Shopping was secondary. This floor also has many loose accent pieces and furniture. So if you are first time visitor, you must take a walk. We had less time and more things to see in detail. I tried my best to curate things and share with you all. I'm yet to study the pattern on how often they change these spaces and all. Hope 
they open their stores in Bangalore soon. There is this separate hub where one can interact with designers if you want to do your interiors from them. After a long walk, we were tired and we thought to settle down for a while. This cafeteria area was extremely big. The concept of taking trolley and picking up food items you like, adding empty cups for hot beverages and glasses for cold was something new. Okay. And finally, the billing is done seeing the food items in your trolley. and then we have to head to market hall to order our uh, items that we are going to take so yeah this is the place where one can shop regular visitors can skip the display tour and head directly here you can find all your products from the inspirational floor in this section The crockery and kitchen zones were explored to the fullest, but I guess we missed the portion where one can find big furnitures. Piece 
It was already 8.15 p.m. and we had no patience left. R was very cooperative. So did a very quick swapping. Well, man to bohat kush lane ka tha, par had to settle with few. Do we come inside? Well, now the most awaited part of the video is the hall. I went there thinking I will shop some crockeries but ended up buying these. Crockeries were heavy and keeping in mind the weight barriers in flights, I couldn't bring much. Other things are home delivered, so carrying them didn't make sense. Pick some useful and helpful products. Well, I'm saving money to shop my heart out once they are here in Bangalore. If you are glued till here, thank you so very much. I hope it gave you a very brief knowledge and now you know what to do when you are at IKEA. Keep supporting this channel. Please drop your inputs on this video below on my comment box and help this channel grow. Subscribe, like, share with the ones who need this guide and yes, hit the bell icon to get notified of all my new uploads. Meet you all soon. Till then, stay safe. Bye-bye.